Liquid CPU coolers like the RGB series or RGB Elite series offer flexibility in terms of lighting and cooling control, letting you control the lighting and cooling performance of the fans with an ARGB-capable motherboard or by taking direct control over the lighting and fans using a Commander Core XT. Before you start setting up your Corsair RGB series or RGB Elite series cooler in IQ, make sure that the pump cable is connected to your motherboard CPU fan header. All RGB cables and the PWM cables for your fans should be connected to your Commander Core XT. In IQ, navigate to the Commander Core XT tile. Go to Lighting Setup. Here, IQ can attempt to auto-detect what is connected to the Commander Core XT, or you can manually select what devices are connected to each port that match the number of LEDs. For this video, we're using an RGB Elite Series cooler with 16 LEDs on the pump head and two fans on the radiator with 8 LEDs each. We'll select an LLRGB Series fan for port number 1 since that matches the 16 LEDs of the pump cap. If you have an RGB Series cooler, you can select that from the menu. Then pick 8 LED Series fans for ports 2 and 3 for our radiator fans. Once lighting setup is complete, you can now customize the lighting of your cooler using any of the presets and custom effects available in IQ. If you'd like to adjust the cooling performance for the fans, go to Cooling and select from any of the available presets or create your own. Note that the pump performance will not be controlled by IQ as we recommend connecting the pump to the CPU fan header on your motherboard for optimal performance. And that's it for setting up your Corsair RGB series or RGB Elite series liquid CPU cooler with the Commander Core XT. Thanks for watching.